Hello everybody, Half Peeps here. Valve just released a brand new Steam UI update, completely overhauling the original Steam UI that we've had since roughly like 2014 maybe. You'll notice it's very quick here, but we're originally greeted with this brand new loading screen, uh, very Steam Deck inspired. And then we're brought right in here. You can see down here we've got a brand new notification. And then of course we're launched into the, uh, the store pages, that's what I have set to default. So you can see up here we've got brand new tab selection on a completely different font, uh, as well as on the right hand side, uh, new Steam news button, notifications, and of course your account. So let's start up here with this brand new Steam button. Uh, if we click this, you get of course change account, sign out, go offline, all the usual stuff. But a lot of stuff here now now has a brand new UI. For example, uh, check for Steam client updates, brings this bar at the bottom, tells you you're all updated because I'm on the latest patch. Uh, we've also got the settings, which now has this this uh, UI here. Once again, very inspired by the Steam Deck UI. Heading over to View. We could, of course, bring up library, hidden game soundtracks, downloads as usual. But everything else here has also received a brand new update to its UI. So Players now gives you this new UI, all in the same theme. It's actually very interesting because... Steam has not had a consistent theme, as far as I remember, uh, as far as I've been using it. I don't think Steam has really been consistent since maybe the green theme. You can see here game servers has been completely redone. Brand new UI for the server browser. Same for screenshots. Brand new screenshot UI. Inventory, of course, just takes you straight to your inventory, so that's that's still the old UI because that's a web web page. And update news brings up, as it always has, the the latest Steam game uh, sales. Friends is obviously the same as it was. The Friends UI received an update quite a long time ago at this point, but it does have a new icon down in the bottom corner. What is also new is the activate a product on Steam window, which now comes with a brand new activation UI as well as the UI to add a non-Steam game to your library. Up here, of course, as I previously mentioned, the new Steam News Page button has been updated, as well as the Notification button, and your Account button. Something else to note is the new Web Browser UI. One handy feature is if you click the link up here, it copies it automatically to Clipboard with this cool animation. Context menus have also received a new look. Here's another look at another context menu. There is now a new downloads menu for when downloading games. As well as a new downloads bar down the bottom. There are now more UI changes in the in-game overlay. This is the new Steam in-game overlay. You can see here we have a gameplay o game overview, the total playtime, playtime in the last two weeks, as well as some guides. Next we have the achievements, which has received a complete overhaul. The next feature is completely brand new, which is the new notes feature. This allows you to make notes in-game without ever tabbing out. Discussions opens up the Steam discussion page for the game you're in. And Screenshots brings up the new screenshot library that was shown earlier. Friends brings up the Friends UI as it always has. And Web Browser opens the new Web Browser. I don't remember if the old web browser had tabs, but I don't think it did. I never used it very often, but I might now. The new one has tabs. Very helpful. Next we have the soundtrack player. You can browse through your soundtracks. 
choose one to play. Controller settings is then here if you have a controller connected, as well as Steam settings. There's a new music playing icon up in the top right. This opens up the music UI. If you have multiple accounts connected to Steam, you'll now see this new user select UI. This gives us a closer look at the animated background we saw in the Steam loading screen. And that's a first look at the new Steam UI. Hope you all enjoyed, this is of course quite a departure in my usual content, but anything UI really excites me so I wanted to make a video on this. Hope you're all doing well, I wish you all the best.